Welcome to a video from the DigitalLifestyle.com. New Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 21296 for Windows Insiders on the Dev Channel. What was known as Fast Ring. Just a few fairly minor changes with this build, to be honest. Uh, Microsoft say they're rolling out an update to the Converge Clipboard. That's the Windows V Clipboard. And this is called the Converge Clipboard that's part of the keyboard, the emoji picker, and uh, all built into one. So there's the Converge Clipboard. And so I could pin something like that, and then that'll always stay at the, list of, the top of the list of my clipboard. So not a huge amount of changes. I've been working on this from time. I do like this new emoji picker and uh, in combination with the new keyboard as well. So that's quite good. The so another change is uh, the ability to manage storage spaces within settings. Um, that was there for some people, but not for everybody. In, in the previous build, it took you to the old LMC snap-in, but this is the, the, uh, the new way of doing it. So those are the only main changes. The rest are uh, fixes. They fixed some issues with games that weren't working, like Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, and Black Ops. They wouldn't launch. Um, they fixed some issues where the game by game bar was launching for um, it's not by itself without pressing Windows G. I actually had that when it just appeared. I wasn't even playing a game. But anyway, um, they fixed some issues with back with the um, program compatibility assistant and some issues with uh, Explorer hanging. And I did have that as well. This I'm running this on a Surface. Uh, go and it was a bit sluggish. I found that build in the um, the previous build. This seems to be a bit better. They've also fixed the uh, X64 emulation, uh, which broke in one of the updates after last week's main build. And there's also an updated Visual C runtime as well for ARM users. So there is still some known issues like uh, again, State of Decay 2, 32 um, bit systems may lo lose connectivity. Um, which is a bit of an issue if you've got a 32-bit version of Windows and uh, you lose network connectivity and you can't get the new build. I'm not sure how they're going to fix that. Uh, low frame rate to Miracast, that's the where you project the screen. And Aero Shake is disabled in this build as well. Um, Aero Shake, you might remember. It's a fairly old feature now, but uh, this is where you could get a window uh, like that and uh, you could shake it and it would minimize everything else. Let's open something else. So you go like that, and it would just minimize everything else. There is a registry setting to um, to change it back on if you really uh, want it uh, fixing. And the other thing that they said they've d updated some um, issues with the new news and interest uh, section as well. Um, so they shrunk down the space it needs apparently, and uh, they fixed some CPU type issues with it as well. So that's it really with this build. There's not a huge amount to see, but uh, it is good that um, they're getting through some of these issues with the bugs and get uh, like arm issues and getting that working as well. So thanks for watching this video. You can see more on the digitallifestyle.com. I'm at iStixon on Twitter.